Hi guys, it's Odara. So today I'm doing a uh, fall time, the fall time favorite tag. And at first I want to apologize for not having a video on Monday. I had actually had a video all like recorded and ready to like um, upload into my computer and everything. But I saw it was going to be a first impressions on the Becca powder foundation but it looked so bad on me like it just looked i mean the foundation itself was good but the color was just so off so i decided not to post it because i i mean like usually i would just let it go and post it but it was just really 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 bad like i couldn't i couldn't do it like it just it looked like blackface and i was like i can't even like upload a video and insult myself like what the heck like it was super dark um so i'm gonna go get the right color um foundation the powder one because i really did like it and i'm gonna do a review on it in a demo so um i will redo that video i just can't do a first impression because that color was just way too it was just way too red and even this foundation looks a little red in the camera too i just i think i'm going i i change undertones i feel like i don't know maybe it's just me or i just like change opinions about my skin but I feel like I've been a little bit more like golden yellow undertone lately and my foundations are just a little bit too red so I'm gonna have to be doing a new foundation look soon because or finding a new foundation soon because I just feel like I don't really like any of my foundations lately I don't know I'm gonna go ahead and read the questions really quickly and then we will answer some questions Okay, so I'm going to be that weird girl on YouTube who doesn't actually like candles. Like, I don't have any candles. If I I bought some from Bath & Body Works before. Um, they're cool. Like, they smell good. I don't have a favorite. I don't do it all the time. Um, I don't buy, like, it's not a big deal for me if I don't have candles everywhere. Usually, I just buy, like, the Glade plugins, um, the scented ones, and I put that in so my room smells nice. But I'm not really a candle person. I don't know. I've just never been one. I have a few um really fall colors fall season i love dark colors so i love dark purples dark um burgundies dark browns um black anything i like just dark lip colors and so here are some of my favorites there's a lot and a lot of, mostly what i wear is liquid lipsticks for my lip colors i just love liquid lipsticks because they last all day and my favorite are from anastasia um so I love all of them and I don't want to show you. I'm going to do a liquid lipstick collection video soon. So I'm not going to add that in here because I have a lot of liquid. I have a lot of lipsticks in general, but um, I just want to kind of do liquid lipsticks separately. But um, okay, so some of my favorite regular lipsticks. I love lace. This one I got from um, Melt. Um, ew, it broke. That's not cool. Um, it broke. Mm. I don't want it to break. I really like this color. This is a really, really good nude. Um, it's just really, it like, it blends in with my skin tone. And sometimes, you know, when you, they say nude for, and I, you know, usually you don't want it to blend with your skin tone, but I kind of like that look sometimes. Um, and you know, when they usually say nude, nude on me would be like white. <laughs> so that's not cute. But this one is kind of like a, like a really like, good in between between like a regular nude and like a darker skin tone nude it has a little bit of a brownish color in there so i really like that color another one from melt is dark room um and this is like a burgundy a dark burgundy red love this color um it's just such a nice like wine color um great for fall um show you the other one from melt is 666 and honestly i hate the name it just makes me uncomfortable, but I love the color. It's a dark purple. I have another one um, by uh, Kat Von D that I really like. That is, I just I think it's in my purse somewhere, and I didn't want to go get my purse. Um, but it's called Homegirl, which is a really really fly. I love that nude. It's just super fly. But um, I mean not nude, uh, dark purple. Um, I really like that. And then some of my other favorites from Mac. Um, this one is smoked purple. This is another purple dark purple and it's kind of like a grayish purple love this color so much it like really does remind you of smoked purple when you put it on I just love it um, this one right here is cyber which everybody loves and knows and love one of the darkest purples you will find it kind of reminds me of the Kat Von D uh, uh, homegirl I have a lot of like this kind of dark purple um, shades I have a lot of those so 
let me see what else um i have riri Ru, which you know it's the same thing as ruby Ru, but um the rihanna version i love this red it's a blue deep blue red and i love blue reds um above all else because i just think they look better on my skin tone um i don't really i mean i have orange reds and stuff like that but i think the blue reds look better on me and then film noir from um mac it's also just a brownish color and um it's really really pretty brown and this one is a satin finish and i usually only buy matte finishes from mac but i really like this because it's not as drying as um matte finishes so those colors i really do like and i have a whole bunch of more i just didn't want to bore you guys with like going through basically my whole lipstick collection don't have it with me right now um i do go to starbucks i don't go a lot and i don't really it's not really a fall time i hate pumpkin spice lattes i think they're they're just too sweet for me and i i had it once and i just was like i got almost sick from it because it was so sweet but i really usually when i go to starbucks i get two drinks either very very hibiscus um the like tea i just like it it's really refreshing it's low very low on calories so i can get like a larger version and like the venti or trenta and not feel as bad um, and another thing I like to get is a, oops, what, let me, I don't know how to say it, like all fancy and all Starbucksy and stuff like that, but it's like the skinny, um, skinny camel macchiato upside down, and, um, it's just, a, oh, iced camel, so I like it iced, <laughs> I don't really like any hot drinks, um, and, um, it's just, upside down just means they mix it, because if they don't say upside down, you'll see, like, a big thing of, like, milk and a big thing of, like, espresso. So, upside down just means they mix it. So, those are the two drinks I always get. So, I have, um, I'm not a big blush person. Um, the one I have on now is Max Raisin, which is awesome, what is a favorite, because it's very natural. I'm not a big blush person, because I, I hate looking like I have a bl bunch of blush on. But, um, some of the ones that I do love to use, and I use repeatedly is this one by sleek and coral it's a nice orangey color it has a little bit of shimmer in it and then i also love um my favorite that i use almost all the time and it's actually um hip pan but it's it's by milani and it's called my tie it's just like a nice pink color but it doesn't look like super pink on my cheeks it actually looks really natural so i love this and i think it's discontinued so i don't I have to look. I haven't actually looked for it in a while because I have a lot of blushes to go through. And then the last one I like to use is this one from Chanel and it's called Plum Attraction. And it's a very pretty purple. So these, usually like those are the type of colors. So like either a brownish, like very natural colors for my blushes. I do have some that are a little, add a little bit more color but I do it very like lightly because like I said I'm not big on blush. So... For the fall i've always lived in hot areas so um i was in texas before i'm living in california now and it doesn't really get that cold it doesn't um it's not like something where you really need to wear a jacket like all the time or something so if i had to say what my favorite fall time item is um clothing item i love booties um so any type of booty uh shoes i'm obsessed with um I wish I could wear over the knee boots, but I have big thighs, so that's not going to work. And I love um, vests, like um, no, sleeveless vests. Um, so let me show you. I'll show you this one. I can't find my white one right now. I think it's in the laundry. But this is one of them that I got from the Limited and the um, Scandal collection. But it's just like a nice tan vest with no sleeves. It's really good to layer with on top of um other things Ooh, what is a favorite fall movie like scary movie like halloween movies mm, what's a good fall movie i should have thought about this more say one hocus pocus is a really good one um it comes on all the time like on for halloween like abc family halloween um they do hocus pocus Hocus a lot, hocus pocus, hocus pocus a lot. So maybe that. Um, I used to love. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why this made me think of it, but Mary Kate and Ashley movies like back in the day when they were like kids. I used to love those type of movies. Um, 
and they had one, I think there was one like Thanksgiving where they were either going to like their grandmother's house or something like that. They also had one called Double Double Trouble. Double, I don't know if it was Double Trouble or Double Double Toil and Trouble, but when they were like, um, had to do like witches or something. It was like, it was cute. I remember watching that when I was a kid. Um, but yeah, so let's say Olsen Twin movies and Hocus Pocus because that's the only thing I could think of for fall. I am obsessed with TV and every year, I um, every fall season, I love the fall season because that's when all the shows come back. And every fall season, I um, will pull up my like premiere calendar on TV Guide and I like make sure to, to see when all the shows are coming back and see what new shows are. And I always give most new, I, don't, I want to say every new show, I don't usually give all the new shows I love, but I always give every new show a, um, I watch them and then I make my decision. I, I give them two episodes and if they can't get me in those two episodes, like I'm usually done. Um, but favorite fall is obviously Scandal. Empire, I have to say I'm a little iffy with Empire right now. I'm waiting for them to pick it back up. Um, but Empire, Scandal, basically TGIT. Scandal, Grey's, How to Get Get Away with Murder. Like, that don't, I, that's all I do on Thursday night. Um, oh, uh, Walking Dead, which is coming back this weekend. Um, obsessed with even though it gives me the highest anxiety ever um, what's it I like some comedies like Modern Family Blackish um, I used to love Stalker I wish they would they didn't cancel that Mindy Project is good um, I love a lot of TV I watch a lot so that's just some of it Oh, I love Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving is actually my favorite Hollywood, uh, Hollywood, <laughs> holiday, holiday because I just, I, it's fun. We all get together. It's usually like Christmas, we're traveling, so it's not, and we're, even though we're still together, but sometimes we won't be together because we travel at like, different times. Um, but Thanksgiving, I love, we all get together. Everybody comes to the, over to the house. Um, but my favorite Thanksgiving food is turkey and stuffing. And I'm sorry, I do love the box stove top stuffing. Like me and my little brother like go in on that. So it'd be always makes fun of us because it's not like the homemade stuffing or whatever. I don't know. I don't care. I love um, box stuffing, the stove top stuffing in particular. In all honesty, I have not dressed up. Oh, I did dress up um, a couple years ago. I dressed up as a... <laughs> I dressed up as a female lion tamer whose lion attacked her and it was really bad I tried to be like all like um uh like fancy with my costume and try to do like the special effects scarring because I had like three like um claw marks going down my face um and so I tried to watch like videos and stuff to see how I do it but it's just it doesn't really work for darker skin tones because the prost what is it called a prosthetic but it's like light skin like it's a light skin so even when I put my foundation on top of it you can still see the light the um, light skin p poking out of it, so I didn't like that, but it, it looked weird, but I mean, it was kind of cool, but that's what I dressed up as one year, um, but it wasn't my favorite costume. Pink Power Rangers when I was a kid, <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I don't, I haven't dressed up in a while, I, or I like just kind of phone it in, and I don't really try that hard because I just like, it was very last minute. I really, really, and I say this every year, that I want to try and do something really cool, like I wish I could do like the special effects makeup, like some of the, like Promise Fawn or Nicole, Nicole Guerrero or something like that, like I wish I could do that because that's what I want to do. I don't want to do like cutesy, I don't want to be like, you know, oh I'm a princess or something like that, like I want to do, I like to do half and half, so princess who is a zombie or like the walking dead princess or something like that. So it's still like cute, but like I look scarred up. So I wish I could do all that special effects makeup and I'm watching their videos trying to like figure out how to do it. So maybe I'll try it this year. That's all the questions. Yeah, that is all the questions I have. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. It's kind of fun just to do a little bit of tag and not do a makeup tutorial. I do have some tutorials planned soon. Um, especially once I find the wrap foundation, um, I'm just kind of going through an awkward period right now from like summer to fall and like my foundations. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you have a great day wherever you are. Please hit subscribe, um, thumbs up this video, comment below and, um, oh, look out for a giveaway soon. I have something special coming up, um, probably closer to the holidays, but go ahead and subscribe now because you will have to be a subscriber to enter. And um, that is it. I have to go. Yep, go now. And um, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.